Welcome once again to an episode of I Take Shit Apart That's Broken. Uh, a buddy of mine gave me this. Power button's not working. If you can't tell, let me spin this around for you. This is a H233H monitor by Asus, or Acer. It doesn't matter. They're all the same. Acer. Uh, so yeah, basically the issue is they can't turn it on because of this stupid button. This fucking thing's dirty. People don't take care of their goddamn screens. Look at this shit. Fucking drinking Mountain Dew playing video games. Take care of your shit, man. I hate it when they do this, but there's no visible screws. So this is a definitely a pry apart, probably front bezel. Yeah, probably this whole thing comes off and then there's screws and then the panel comes off or some shit like that. I guess we'll find out. I'm going to pry. God damn, this is not wanting to go. One thing about having me fix shit is uh, two things. It's going to be cheap because I'm doing it for free. I'm going to charge you if, you know, if I know you. And it's also going to be slow. You know, you're broke. Got no fucking aspirations in life. I get it. I get it. You take the back off first. That's what I didn't think of. And that might not necessarily be true, but I'm, I'm going to take the back off. Just so I can have it uh, not, you know, be in my way. Because it's been in my way. Look at that. Those cocksuckers. They fucking hid one down there. Assholes. Why do they do that? What are you trying to hide, man? Look. The whole fucking thing has no screws on it except for that piece of shit. What was I saying? Oh. I think I was talking about manufactured necessity, but... Who knows? It's too late in the night for that. Okay, so once that's off, I got all these screws out. Where does it go from there? Is it one of those? Hmm. Give me that. Or maybe I should push in. Ha ha! Got it. I'm in. Okay, so starting off from the bottom here. And these fucking bevels, they're so goddamn difficult. This is actually, I lucked out here because it had something to push on. But sometimes these fuckers just almost seamless, almost welded to the plastic. And anytime I try and get them off, I always fucking break something. One of these stupid little things that hook on it. I think I just broke one. This stupid shit. I hate these fucking things. Like, you gotta know exactly where it is so you can, like, eh. eh. Fuck that. Oop. Oh. I, I broke the bezel. That's okay. That's okay. The, du the dude that gave me this basically... Oh, God. It broke again. Oh, God. Anyway. You know, he doesn't care if I break it. I am going to clean it for him because this is... This is too much. Okay. Got it apart. Let's take a look inside. Oh, it's attached. It's attached by a cable and a ribbon cable, and it's dusty as fucking air. So I broke it twice, but, you know, I'm sure he won't give a shit if I fix it. If I don't, maybe he will be mad, but... Anyway. The issue's uh, not in the panel itself. The issue's actually this power button isn't, isn't clicking, and I found out why. Uh, can you see that? This part. So in here is a piece of plastic. That's the that's the power button, and it broke off of that little arm there. That's a horrible design. I don't know how hard he pressed it to fucking turn it off and break it, but he did that. So really, my next question is: Should I should I attach it to that bar again, that little plastic bar, which is the tension? It, you know, it gives it that push, or should I just spring mechanism this fucking thing? You know, I'm gonna take this board off and figure it out. Okay, so I got my baby Phillips. I have a feeling it's not going to fit. It looks just as big as the other ones. Oh, it's just small enough. Good, 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 good. All right. Take this piece of shit out of here. Oh, oh, oh. Don't worry. Once I get this fucking bevel off, it'll be, it'll be great. Wait, are these buttons too? Ah, fucking capacitive buttons. Fucking gross, man. The fuck, they think they're so goddamn witty and fancy. Like, oh, look, it's fucking, it's the future. Where, oh, shit, where's that button? I know it's fucking pitch black in your room and you're trying to play Call of Duty or whatever. 
Where the fuck's the button? You can't fucking find it. Goddamn companies. Pieces of shit. All of them. Okay, before I do anything to this stupid ass board, I'm gonna plug this in and I'm gonna I'm gonna turn it on using the Oh wait, I need the board. <laughs> okay. So I'm gonna plug this board back in and then I'm gonna test it out. Okay, so uh that's on. I'm gonna scoot this over so you can see me press the power button as proof. Make sure I'm not doing some YouTube magic. I'm known for that kind of thing. Uh huh. There it goes. Okay, I saw something on screen for a brief second. Hello? Ah, cable not connected. So this is fine. The panel's fine. There's no cracks. There's nothing. It's fine. We're good. What we need to do is solder something. Oh, and it, it is the, I tested it. It is this point and this point that need to, I can actually attach this straight on like that and then uh, I, I do want it to be how about i wire two wires out of here into each one you know get as, as shitty and as lame as possible how about that i'm sure he'll like that and then i'll figure i'll trickle up i'll figure this out based on whatever 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 right all right guns heating up shit's looking good we got liquor in the bottle and I'm half getting wood. Cheers, assholes. Be sure to clear your area. Clear your area that you're going to use for your soldering iron. You don't want something to trip it up. And then you, whoops, and then fucking boom, your genitals are cooked. Don't do that. Clear your area. OSHA rules. Clear your area. All right, so I'm going to take some of this wire. Okay. I'm going to spin it, I'm going to twist it, I'm going to tighten it, but then I'm going to cut it. Because I don't need that much, I need just the tiniest bit. But I want this, so what you do is, I want this back end to be super tight. I'm going to put it, maybe cut it right there. One swift cut, solder it to that. That's the plan. Whether or not it'll work, I don't know. I could use helping hands, but I don't think it's really going to help here. It's not the it's not the movement of the thing that bothers me. It's the fucking it's the goddamn size of the fucking thing. Okay, so we got that on there. That's cool. Uh, we can cut at any point here. It's fine. Step one. Okay, I ended up just taking the. Uh, little power module off i just ripped it off it's it's getting in my way there's only four uh points there and i think according to my diagram i'm looking at it right all i need to do is short these two or okay so i skipped a couple steps on camera because i ran out of space but uh i basically dirty welded the the cables on there uh and i don't trust in the solidity of it i did test i shorted it on the monitor it turns it on I'm going to put some, uh, some bonding agent. Uh, so this is a thing that I wanted to show you a while ago. And this is a, this is a UV activated bonding agent. It's really strong. It's really good. Yeah, I'm, I'm working on it. See, just put it right on there. It doesn't have to be on there for very long. It's like three seconds. It's just amazing. This shit's amazing to me. Okay. So turn that off. Yep. Nice and solid. Look at that shit. That is like, it's like those, uh, I don't know if this is what they use in, in industry or not, or something similar. There's a little bit of that cable exposed. I'm going to cover some more of it. Trust me, this is one of the sloppiest soldering jobs I've ever done, but I'm, I'm, I'm done fucking with these little points. I don't, I don't like working with that shit. They're so fucking tiny. <laughs> what I could do, I could just plug this in and tell them, all right, every time you want to turn on your monitor, just short these two cables. So while my soldering iron is uh, warming up, I'd like to take this time to thank my sponsor, Audible. Audible has a thousand billion books and none of them are the ones that you want. They don't have any Sart. They don't have any Flyboy G-Jack, Lacan, none of that shit. There's always books about the author, but there's never books by the author that I'm looking for. Audible.com forward slash we don't have anything 
Also, you have to pay for a subscription and also pay per the book that you get, and they're not clear about that. Dot com promo code. Fuck you. So now basically I have to attach this to this and have it be springy. You know? I might have this as the intermediary between this and this thing like that. And then I can this is sturdy enough. And I could cut something I could cut something out of this and then attach this to the frame so it has some actual rigidity to it instead of some fake ass bullshit. There we go. Aha! All right, so I skipped a couple steps in front of you. I apologize. I took uh, a little something-something microfarads capacitor. I already glued this on here. I already put holes in here. So what I'm going to do is going to use this. I'm not going to use hot glue because hot glue, you know, wear and tear. It gets loose. Oh, wait. Before I do that, uh, I got to make some hash marks here um, for, the, for the glue to hold. Kind of still sticky, which is okay. I kind of want that. I want to build a stem up using this, so I'm going to put a little bit more on top. This is going to be the little stem that sticks out from the side. Okay, so this is this is basically done. I'm going to have it so it's fucking after that, and then that'll tie it in. It probably won't work, but I'll, I'll give it a shot. Who knows? Clean my nail here. There you go. Yeah. That should do the trick. I'm going to turn this off. Really get in there. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this little baby thing. We'll place it right in there. Right in there. Oh, wrong way, silly. You silly willy. Screw this in there. Aha. Last one goes there. Yeah, no, hey, that's fine. That is fine. Hot started that. Screwed it in. Haven't plugged this in. I'm going to spin it around. So what I'm going to do here... Almost spilt my beer. So what I'm going to do here is plug and tuck. Plug. Tuck this fucker back in there. And... With the grace of an elephant, we will jam this fucking cable into its place. And this ribbon cable. And everything else that I'm fucking fucking up. Alright. Yeah, so this goes down first. And then this. The downside is you're not going to be able to see an LED there, but or wherever it's supposed to pop up. But you'll be able to see the menu come up. So that's good enough. Okay, plugged in. Oh, there it goes. Look at that. Okay, let me turn it off. Yep, no signal. You're welcome, Hunter. Fix it yourself next time.